In this video, I want to give you a general idea about the different type of the arrow foils you can find on the internet. For example, for the S809, you can find this one from the, the PDF file on the NREL website. And from here, you can get the X and Y, which is Z here, coordinates for the upper and lower surface. And uh, here you can uh, go for the NREL arrow foil families for the horizontal axis wind turbines. And you can find out the many type of arrow files here. For example, here we have the blade length is 125. And the power rating is 2 to 20 kilowatts. And the arrow file thickness category is a thick. And type of arrow file on the root and tip, they are given as a 823 and the 822. And then there are other arrow files, for example, for the case number 10 to 15 meters blade length. And power is a 150 to 400. They have used the 8A09 at the 75% location, which is a primary arrow file. And in this support, they have used the same arrow file for the NREL phase 6 wind turbine. And here they have provided all the data about this wind turbine using the same arrow file, which is S809. And on this website, which is again NREL website, you can find out the coordinates of the S809 arrow file from the arrowfilestools.com. Also, you can find out the same file. Again, the same, same website. This is the geometry of the NREL phase 6 wing or the blade. And at the 75% 75, 75 location, we have the S809 arrow file. And uh, other arrow files are at the root, which is start from 25% spin location. And other arrow file type is on the tip. And on the base, we have the circular cross section. And here we have the discussion about the NREL 5 megawatt rotor geometry. And he's discussing about the different arrow files at different locations and the naming connection. And the main designer who designed these arrow files has answered the question. You can check the website also from here. This is the website name here. And for the for this discussion, I have the, all the arrow files placed in the one Excel sheet. These are the arrow files for the horizontal axis wind turbines like NACA 64618, DU93W210LM. And the LM stands for the adjusted tailing edge thickness with the original DU arrow files. And on this side, we have the two arrow files, DU06W200. And this is the arrow file for the vertical axis wind turbine. And similarly, we have the NACA 0018 arrow file, which is also for the vertical axis wind turbine. And you can find our profiles coordinates here. And the shape of the arrow file is shown here. And for the horizontal axis wind turbines, they are plotted in a one graph here. And you can check the properties of these arrow files here. So NACA 64618 and DU93W210. 91W250, 97W300.